always loved digging in the earth ever since I was like eight years old and there's nothing nicer than putting your hands in earth. Midway down France there's this rich dark orangey red soil rich in iron and I just want to lay in it <laughs> and it's just oh just to feel it on your back if you dig in the earth you can get energy from the earth and I believe that and when I'm working I believe it. Yeah I'm really into earth Hi, I'm Ginny. I'm an English chick. <laughs> Clay is my passion. When you're really had a bad day at work and you need to like really calm yourself, getting on the wheel is just a, it centers you as well as you're centering the clay, it centers your mind because you have to totally focus and you have to totally be at one with the clay. It's like my church. The fact that people have been doing this for thousands of years and using clay to make utilitarian pieces and beautiful art at the same time, um, there's definitely something that f fills a, a void in you when you're throwing. It's just like a, it is a very spiritual feeling. It's pretty cool to take a lump of clay and then make something you can drink out of, you know, it's just a, it's pretty amazing. I feel like I couldn't find my voice until like the last couple of years. And then when I started doing the textural pieces, more and more of the carving, that's when I found my voice. And the glaze too, but mostly it's the surface texture. I like the matte surfaces, I like glossy surfaces, but it's all about the, the shadow it causes and, and the texture. There is a lot of love that goes into these pieces and that's what I want people to take away with them. That love and appreciation of, of that it's handmade. Pottery, I think you need to pick it up and handle it. You need to feel it. It's again, it's the texture, it's how it feels in the hand. I would like somebody to take my piece and go, this is one of the best mugs and I love using this mug. I think if it gives somebody pleasure, and hopefully every day, because if they're using something functional and I want people to feel, yeah, like this is something they just love to hold. They love the feel of it and, and they cherish it. And I'd like somebody to cherish my work just like I cherish it. When I'm making my pieces, there's a lot of love that goes into this. And it's sometimes hard for me to part with pieces. <laughs> crazy but sometimes when I've worked on something and it's just part of me I don't want to let it go it's really hard and um oh dear excuse me <laughs> um and why make it if I don't want to share it so you have to let it go with love how can I stupid cry over a piece of pottery <laughs> I love being outside, you know, um, and I love s sitting here and hearing the birds, rolling out clay, making stuff. I can't think of anything more wonderful. My hands in clay all day. <laughs>